Hello, I'm Lizzie Kaplan, and I'm going to roll these dice, and then I'm going to tell you a story based on what we learn from said dice. Funniest TV roll. Well, I'm going to have to give that one to Casey Klein on Party Down. There's no idea what the f is going on in there. There were only 20 episodes ever made of that show, and I'm very, very proud of it, and I'm very, very proud of that character. She was just like my perfect match. I never had any idea how many people it takes to make a useless product that nobody needs. And you should watch it if you haven't seen it, IMDb. I figured that my natural hilariousness would have tipped you off right. by now. Oh no. <laughs> Scariest castmate. I was really scared to work with Michael Sheen on Masters of Sex. Audacious, tireless, dedicated and brilliant. Partly because when we first met at this lunch, he had just played Jesus Christ in a passion play that he created in his hometown in Wales that had 2,000 townspeople also participating in the play. I both understand and sympathize. And I had just done a movie with Dane Cook. What are you doing here? What is he doing here? Next, most memorable scene. I'm gonna have to do another Masters of Sex one, actually. Think of the publicity, Bill. It was the moment that uh, we scratched our head about uh, a bit on Masters of Sex, uh, a show that I'm very, very, very proud of and stand behind. But this particular scene was a man in a gorilla suit. There was a female gorilla. That was the guy's son in a girl gorilla suit. I had to take my top off to try to get the male gorilla in the mood to have sex with the female. Gorilla, again, played by his son, and then uh, they simulated gorilla sex in their, in their outfits. It does sound like fun, doesn't it, Bill? Unexpected Hollywood encounter. They're all a bit unexpected, aren't they? Oh, here's one. I wouldn't say it was an encounter because we still have yet to exchange any niceties, but I was at the Netflix building just this week and Martin Scorsese walked by. Hey, it's Marty Scorsese. And I freaked out and like fully was staring at him. There's not really something I wish I had said because it would have gone badly. I don't understand. I don't think there's any story where somebody goes up to Martin Scorsese in a lobby of a building. You got a minute to talk? Says the magic combination of words that lands them their dream job. And I love to offer you a part in my new picture. I feel like it's probably like, oh, you're amazing and I think you're amazing. And he goes, yeah, nice to meet you. And then, you know, shuffles away quickly. I know that he's listening, but somehow it's not enough. So now you know everything about me. That's the story, soup to nuts. If you would like to see more of me, if this little taster isn't enough, then tune in to Castle Rock on Hulu and Truth Be Told on Apple TV+. Those are channels.